to the basket and almost finished it with a left hand. Geiger blocks the shot out of bounds and and then got himself a nice break. He probably could have used it. He played 41 minutes. Iverson to Snow. Nice bounce pass to Geiger. Horace is there, but Geiger lays it in. Penny reached up and he hit a bomb or his hand. I wonder if Alan Iverson will come out of the game here. I don't know. Um, Aaron McKee up very quickly, and I thought it might have been a travel, just simply, uh, there's Penny hitting his hand on the rim. Went on to the basket. Right. Anderson's double teamed in a hurry. It looked like Randall got there off real quickly. And Stur gets the rebound. Dagger shooting at the other end, gets the easy bucket. That Darryl Armstrong, that moves Hardaway back out to the point guard. No, gives it to Geiger. A tough turnaround jumper, and he backs it in. Should be the lead again. He takes Outlaw off base one. Nice challenge by Grant, but Geiger puts down the jumper. He did. Iverson's shot won't go, but Ratliff is there to follow. It's an utterly ball, and Geiger chases it down. Oh, uh, you're seeing a, a team right now in Philadelphia get into every loose ball. 19 of 50 is all they've been able to make here, and I have to think if they would could put together any kind of run. Hardaway, meanwhile, this both bounce shot. So it's still a seven-point field out to the lead. Geiger. Yeah. Well, he's been hot from out there. Matt Geiger has eight in the quarter, 18 in the game. Really double teaming and a bad pass is stolen by Geiger. And a nice defense. Much easier to get that ball entered from the wing than from up top. Geiger open for the foul line. It is a 17-point lead for the 76ers. Commanding lead against the Magic. Back victories on this young, short NBA season.